Now, let's answer question from random post na nakapost dito sa Philippine Civil Service Review for All at galing ito kay Sir Lenzel Alimbuyao. Word problem. The sum of two numbers is 19. If five times the smaller number is three less than twice the larger number, what are the numbers? Let's do solution number one. Doon tayo sa choices. Five times daw sa smaller number. So sa choice A, yung smaller number niya ay 7. So 5 times 7 is equal yan siya. 3 less than twice sa larger number. So larger number ay 12. So 12 times 2 less than 3. Tingnan natin kung equal ba yan. This is 35. And this one is 24 minus 3 at yan ay 21. So, hindi yan siya. Letter B. Ang smaller number ay 6. Yan ang i-multiply natin ng 5 equals yung larger number twice the larger number minus natin ng 3. So, this is 30. 13 times 2. This is 26 minus 3. Hindi na naman siya equal. Letter C. Itong smaller number, i-multiply na naman natin ng 5. Tapos, si bigger number, yung larger number na 14, yan ang i-multiply natin ng 2 minus 3. 5 times 5, 25. 14 times 2, and this is 28 minus 3, and that is exactly 25. So, equal sila. In other words, ang sagot dito ay letter C. Now, let's solve this using algebraic way. The sum of two numbers is 19. Let x and y be our two numbers. So, sum, i-add natin yan. 19. Sum means addition. Next. If 5 times the smaller number, let x be our smaller number. So, 5x is equal yan siya. Now, 3 less than means minus 3 sa twice the larger number. So, yung y ang larger number natin. Twice of y minus 3. Ipagsama natin yung mga variables katulad nito, x plus y. So, ipagsama natin sila. Itong si... 2y, since positive 2y yan siya, kapag matransfer, pang minus na siya sa 5x. So, that will be 5x minus 2y. Then, equals minus 3 or negative 3. Next, ito yung bali first equation natin. Ito yung second equation. Yung first equation natin, pwede natin i-multiply ng 5. Pwede rin i-multiply natin ng 2. Saan galing si 5 or si 2? Pwede i-multiply ng 5 para makancel out si x. Pwede i-multiply ng 2 para makancel, makancel out si y. Now, pipiliin ko lang si 2 para mas madaling mag-multiply ng mga numbers. 2 times x and this is 2x. 2 times y, and this is yung addition, 2y. 19 times 2, so mas madali lang. And this is 38. Next, i-combine natin yan lahat dito. So, i-add lang natin itong buong equation na ito. 2x plus 2y equals 38. I-add natin yan sila lahat. 5x plus 2x, this is 7x. Negative 2y plus 2y, so wala na yan siya, 0 na yan. Next, negative 3 plus 38, and this is 35. Para ma-isolate si x, since the 7 pang multiply sa x, Pang divide na siya sa 35. In other words, na divide na ng 7 to both sides para makancel sa 7. X na lang ang matira. 35 divided by 7, and this is 
5. So, ang isang number, yan yung smaller number natin, ay 5. Obviously, sa choices, isa lang naman yung 5. So, ito na yung sagot. Pero, klaruhin lang natin. Balikan natin yung the sum of two numbers is 19. So, x plus y equals 19. Ang value ni x ay 5. So, yung y ang hanapin natin. Ikip natin itong si y. Since si 5 pang add sa y, pang minus na siya sa 19. In other words, nang minus tayo ng 5 to both sides, para makancel si 5 dyan, y na lang ang natira. So, y equals 19 minus 5, and this is 14. So, what are the numbers? 5 and 14. Thank you for watching and all I hope meron kayong naintindihan sa video ito. Thank you and God bless.